So, uh, hello guys, I will just go straight to the point. I don't want to waste your time. You must be seeing the slideshow on the screen and uh, and uh, I will just go straight to the point. We were 45 that chose the number. I got there around, uh, around some minutes before 10 o'clock. I left my house uh, uh, a, a while. I, I was late to actually leave my house. So, I got there around some minutes uh, before uh, 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 10 o'clock and I left there around 5 o'clock. We were 45 that, that, that actually chose the number. 45 all of us 45 uh the woman in green uh uh came with and uh, was alone uh that woman the woman in uh orange was also alone she was speaking to the woman in green was also speaking to the woman uh, a woman laying down there there are about three or four men around there and uh, and uh, that was the woman i met you know beautiful girls these women uh these kids are sick like their eyeballs were actually kind of coming out i saw their i saw their eyeballs they they were like like uh come like i saw their eyeballs even though the, the boys were asleep their boys were actually wide open and, and it was actually very reddish and and so that, that was the case this man is a uh, actually fleecing uh uh uh, 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 uh the the ill So what basically happened there was actually me. I got in there. I asked my motorcyclist to actually stop and actually wait for me. I thought I would just be spending about 30 minutes with the man. But when I got there, I didn't know I would actually find a long queue there. I, uh, I, I took the number 20, 28 and, and, and uh, so it was around 10 o'clock. Everyone been doing one. That was, uh, it, I was, I was the second batch. People wake up there and I could get there by 5, 5 a.m. in the morning. And I thought I was surprised. I went back home, uh, back, I went back to the restaurant, well, one. And, uh, uh, to the restaurant and the place uh, uh, for about till uh, 12.30 p.m. I go, and, and then I, I came back. Huh? So, no, uh, about I, I came back to I do the one. And, and I was surprised that uh, it was just in number six, <laughs> the sixth person. <laughs> still, still 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 still. What I actually discovered was that I wasn't actually spending a lot of time with them. There were the, the exactly. first batch of people were still inside yeah. the house. That was the reason why. I didn't know until the evening when I actually got into the house. I didn't know the second batch were actually just inside the house. I and, 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 and we were just there. The funniest thing, this man doesn't well, value the time. So the time of his time. Mark for the IG chapter 2. Chapter 2. Hey, Jok. Tell everybody what you mean. Sir, 20. 20. Right, yeah. Number twenty. Don't what do you you I
there was something I noticed while I was there, you know. Uh, this sign, I don't know what I would call it, maybe a salvation complex or whatever, whatever the, 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 the savior complex, or whatever you call it. Or that, must be, that must be a kind of uh, anyone investigating uh, uh, a scammer should actually find a way to actually what his victims are actually felt. What they felt was that this kind of all and sense and, and sense that we were the one who actually find the cure. When you look at the videos of those people, you see them, they were laughing a lot, you know, they were laughing, they were actually happy that this is the place to actually find a cure, you know, this is the place to actually where they, all, all their, all their, all their mountains would be, uh, would be made low and, and the corners in their life cost it. And, and I think that was, a, that was this kind of excitement, you know, and, and, and I, I, I was actually sad to actually say that these people have been fixed and they felt like this man is, is the savior and he's maybe the most intelligent Jew priest I've ever met, honestly, he, he was cautious. So, yeah, 
country that took close as this Joe Jackson. He said that uh, he said that he's telling the reason why I was there. And he wrote uh, the name, uh, he asked me to write the name of my grandmother, the person that was sick, in the paper. And then uh, the, the, the video wasn't clear enough, he burnt the paper without reading it. I, I was there, he didn't read the paper. Honestly, he didn't read the paper. But what actually happened is that he has a camera in his house. Every single time, what I observed with every single person, because the person actually said that they actually told me what was going to he left the room, you know, for about four to five minutes. He left the room where, while I was there. I actually had to actually release that part out. So, uh, but he left. You, you actually see that he came back and actually left. And and while while, uh, while I was writing the name, he uh, he went to his room to actually check. He has a camera in the house. That actually, if he goes out, what is going to? He insisted that I write the name of the thing. So he went. To the, the thing is that uh, he said my grandmother is sick. And Without that, she would die. Without his skill, she would die. Also. And but the funniest thing is, my grandmother died five years ago. He insisted that we have to actually pay. We have to actually pay uh, the four family. We have to actually pay ten thousand to actually. We have to actually listen to him. We have to actually pay pay all that. Money. And he insisted. And and the, what, his face was what he actually had to do. His face. He said, who is a GBK? And I wish, I wish the camera was right on his face. I, I felt like slapping him. Can you be a GBK? Uh, God, no. <coughs> Then I think I saw him very violently. Very convinced. Hospital で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、